All right, Shalom, Shalom, I want to give all praise up now. You have Shem, 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 Kakwadash. Peace and bless all the blood ones, baptized, and who cut in for the mission of sins. And today I got a few quick ones, which is going to be Romans chapter 3, verse 21, which says the justification by faith. Right, it says, but now the righteousness of God without the law is manifested. So when it says without the law, what is it talking about? That the righteousness of God that is manifested without the law. All right, so we know that Yahweh Shai is law, right? He is law. He was prophesied, what? In the law, in the, being witnessed in the law and the prophets. So he tell you that this righteousness that's without the law is even written in the law and the prophets, beloved ones. So what is that talking about? It's talking about what? Uh, Moses, he prophesied up to follow the Lord Yahweh Shai. So yes, we follow the Lord Yahweh Shai like what? It was commanded and witnessed in the law. All right, and the prophets, right? Like Isaiah and Jeremiah. All right, the beloveds, they wrote of the Lord Yahweh Shai, man. All right, being witness in the law and the prophets, which it was what that the Lord Yahweh Shai was going to be what? An at uh, atonement for our sins, man. He was going to be our sacrifice, man. All right, well, without the, the uh, service of animal sacrifice under the Levitical priesthood, man. So, so we have that right now. This is why what when when you when you make a mistake, you go to the Lord Yahweh Shai for forgiveness. You don't go to you you don't go pray to them the Pope or uh, damn uh, Levitical priests or or you go to the elders and you know ask for forgiveness. No, we go to the Lord Yahweh Shai when we will uh, we make a mistake. Like the scriptures say, if any man sin, we have an advocate uh, with God, which is the Lord Yahweh Shai. All right, so the righteousness without the law is talking about what? We have what? Yahweh Shai is our sacrifice of this new covenant. All right, without what? The sacrifice of uh, bulls and goats, man. All right, so we're doing, we doing this thing through the Lord Yahweh Shai. All right, and it was what? Witnessed in the law of the prophets, beloved one. So we can't, what, just say the law of the prophets are, uh, are, are vain or void. Because what? The Lord said, none of my words shall return unto me void. All right? The righteousness that, that, that of God without the law is manifested, man. All right? Without the laws of what? Animal sacrifice. This is the new covenant, beloved ones. We're, it's, 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 it's already uh, manifested. It says it's now manifested, baby. So guess what? We don't got to wait to go to Jerusalem to find out about the righteousness of God, man. All right? Without the laws of animal sacrifice. It's already manifested. All right. And Paul said it was even manifested, scattered among the Romans, man. All right. Which is what? That the Lord Yahweh Shah brought forth this new covenant by the way of his sacrifice and his, uh, him shedding his blood. For a testament is of force after men are dead. Right. So the new covenant came into force, man. Yeah, right. Like he said, it is done. So it says, but now, hey, it's now, baby. But now the righteousness of God without the law is manifested, right? So what? We don't need uh, animal sacrifice. We needed what? The uh, sacrifice of the Lord, Yahweh Shai, to make us perfect, man. So with that, all praise, I'm now, y'all, Bashem, Shalom.